Hello and welcome back to Random Bible Verses and Passages. This is Mandy and today we need to be thankful and today for today is the day the Lord has made. I do have another Bible passage for you today and that is Romans 12 9. Uh, it just want to stay say to the start that if you don't have your Bible out grab your Bible look it up read it with me just one one little verse um, if you don't have a Bible go out and get one there you don't have to spend a lot of money on a Bible uh, if your Bible somewhere in the back of your closet in the top of your closet in the drawer I just set out for decoration Go find it, get it out, dust it off, and let's start reading our Bible again because America needs to read our Bible again. We need to get back to God's Word. Well, let me read this this verse for you. It's Romans twelve nine, and it's let love be without dissimulation, abhor. That which is evil cleave to that which is good that's a good verse um it it says it says a lot um love let love be without dismiliation what does that mean i looked it up and it says let love be without Conceal, concealment of one's feelings. Show you love somebody. Don't just keep their, the love you have for someone inside of you. Show it. Show your love. Because God shows his love to us every day. We're still, we're still breathing. We're still alive. So... We gotta love one another. And it doesn't mean the love like between a husband and a wife. Um yeah, show your love to your spouse. That's that's always a good thing. Um but uh it could be, you know, your neighbor, your friend. Um be kind and courteous to people. So abhor that which is evil. What does that mean? I looked that one up too because I wanted to make sure because that's the word we don't use every day. You know, I'm going to go up for you. Uh, it says, regard with disgust, dislike. Stay away from things that are evil, things that are not of God. Stay away from because right now we need to cling to God's word to this book right here to the Holy Bible we need to cling to it stay away from everything that's evil and stay with your Bible it says cleave to that which is good Cleave to your Bible. Cleave to grab, to grab, to cling, to to hang on to, to hold, to not let go. Um, that verse is a verse that some people in the United States right now really need to be reading. Um, there's so much going on in this in this in this this world that it, it makes my heart hurt to know the things that are happening. Um, it, it's, it's a sad situation that we're living in. And we're living in the end times. Um, that trumpet could sound at any, any time. And, in, and to think that we are in such a state that we are in. Um, but we as Christians, we need to be living for God, showing God, and loving our neighbors. Remember 12, 
Romans chapter 12, verse 9. Get your Bible out, look it up, write this verse down, and read it. Um, grab some paper um, and, and jot it down. When you get it, you know, read read the whole chapter. Read read chapter 12. I mean, it's not a long chapter. It's got 21 verses in it. Read it. And um, if you are watching my little videos and you're not saved, I, I beg of you to um, find a preacher. Find someone... That, that can help you if you need help. Get your Bible out and read it. And, um, find God. Ask Him into your heart. Um, and you don't have to be perfect to do that. He wants you just as you are, and He'll change you as you go. As I can guarantee you, I was not a saint, and I still am not a saint. I... I am a sinner, saved by grace. So, but if you need some help, I'd be more than happy to help you. Just leave a little comment below, and I will be more than happy to help you. Um, if you, well, find, find your local church. Um, find somebody, because we all need someone to help us. So, but if you like these little videos, hit that like button, and um subscribe to the channel so you can you can um, hear more of the random Bible verses and passages that I will be doing. I mean, there's so many verses and chapters and books in the Bible that there's so much information and in nowadays now if not we need we need it now. We need it now more than ever. So, I do want to thank you for watching. And, um, God bless.